I'm standing in front of the new project under construction, the Tibet Museum. The construction and planning for the new Tibet Museum in Kanchen Kishon, the seat of Central Tibetan Administration is underway. The new Tibet Museum will be open in December 2018 and will cover 9,000 square feet of exhibition and learning center space. With the new Tibet Museum, we aspire to foster a global community by providing visitors, both on the physical and on the virtual space, a unique opportunity to experience and explore Tibet, a Tibet in its entirety, right from its history to its present to its future. But really, of course, this is a, a people's history museum. This is about a people's history who have not had a chance to tell uh, their own side of the story. The new Tibet Museum will attract Tibetans, Indians and members of the international community. The museum will serve not only as a repository of Tibetan culture and uh, political memory, but also as uh, an educational centre for students, scholars and researchers. I see this museum not only as the chance for it to be a museum that is uh, highly emotional, um, emotional in terms of uh, the stories it can tell, the individual stories that it can tell uh, through the voices of Tibetans and their experiences, but it's also a place that can be a campaigning museum, a museum that will uh, hopefully uh, push visitors to do more uh, for all kinds of issues, whether that is in human rights, the environment, uh, once they leave the museum. I am very happy to be one of the content developers for the environment section of the new Tibet Museum. A museum of Tibet and Tibet people will be incomplete without a prominent presence of Tibet's environment issues. With almost four times as much space as the existing current museum, the new museum will expand on 11 permanent themes through its exhibitions and programs, and content developers, uh, given their areas of expertise, were hired to curate and develop the content for the new museum. And likewise, a meeting of the content developers were held in October last year and in Jan this year as well. The making of a museum requires uh, actually uh, uh, input of an expert, a curator and a team of consultants such as uh, interior designer Sonal, graphic designer Marcus and Alex, curator Dr. Emma Martin and Nicole Crawford and sound work director Jack who have been at the helm of the project leadership. It's so important to have so many different people from a diverse amount of backgrounds here because museum work doesn't happen in a vacuum. The new Tibet Museum will tell the story of Tibet, that of an illustrious history of a past independent nation, an atrocious past of oppression and occupation, a contemporary story of resistance and resilience, and a future premised on hope. With this, we hope to engage visitors and viewers on the issue of Tibet for a long, sustainable future. Hence, this project is very, very important. This is one of the biggest projects Tibetan administration has launched.